Let's go to the next thing. So now you're on the road. He's um, calling you here and there. I mean, is this also the time when he was already with this new girl? Did he still try to reach out to you and try to be cool with you? Or he kind of knew it's it's over? Or he's still trying to mingle and dingle with you? Well, that's what I'm saying. Like, he hadn't reached out since that, since I found out. Because he was still calling me all the way up until until she put it out yeah. on the internet, right? So he was calling me up until that point. Like, literally the night before, probably. Yeah. Um, and then after that... I sent him a JPay. So for y'all that don't know, Prison World JPay is the how you can like email a prisoner and it can get to them like in the next day. Yeah, because they can't email you, but you can email them. So I just sent him that email. You know, called him all kinds of names, and basically told him not to contact me ever again. So he didn't for a while, and then, and then here we come in the picture. And so, then, so then let's get to we that. We're on tour. So, yeah, so we're on tour. We already. Told you know it was the last yeah. night of our tour. Yes, for that so, yes, we're yeah. like, hey, you know, we, you know, we don't associate with that kind of stuff. This and that, blah blah. So it was one day, last show, successful, sold out show in Colorado. Had a great time. Yeah, we're all ready to leave the next day back to our. Obviously, people missed their flights too because of that. <laughs> Everybody missed their flight. <laughs> but yeah, I'm because I'm, of that. So I'm in my room just chilling, um, about to go to sleep, and then destiny weird stuff but i just i never call nobody facetime so i call um shots out lazy dub from arizona so yeah, just to let everybody know this is not a california versus texas thing no this is just a reality man thing right so lazy he's from arizona same etiquette no matter where you're from texas california florida whatever he's from arizona um and he he obviously felt the same way situation and I, i'm on the facetime with him he's just showing me because there's a guy in our in one of the rooms, he was a little drunk and he yeah, was falling yeah, yeah, apart. Yeah. So, like, show this me this our, fool. This, we were just doing like a, we we're having yeah. an after party. Yeah. So, first of all, it was an after party for the fans. Yeah, for the fans yep. after the show. It's late. I don't. I, we're still up for some reason. We're yeah. still up late. We've been talking. Exactly. We've been, so yeah. I'm in my room. I'm like, you know, I'm just going to sleep. I'm chilling. I just like let me. I'm but I can't sleep. So I'm like, put me on Facetime, dog. Let me see this drunk guy over there falling apart. So he puts it on him. Yeah. This guy's falling apart. Then within like five minutes later, a phone call starts ringing, ding, 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 ding. And then um, I can hear Lazy like, who the fuck is this? And I guess he has your phone. And he's like. And I didn't even know that. Yeah. He's I, didn't like, even, I didn't have my phone with yeah, me, so I don't even he's know like, what's going who, on. He's like, who the hell is this? This calling from prison. What? You still, you know, this guy's still calling you? Well, it says his name. Okay, so whatever it was, he, he like. On the call. Boom. So it he, says his name, yeah. So he, he, answers, <laughs> he answers the phone call. I'm on FaceTime still while he puts my phone down, kind of, and I'm still listening to the whole him talk. He's like, you you know, he's saying all this, you know, yeah. you know, like a man to man. Hey, you you no good. You a piece of boom, boom, boom. Like the shit's going on. Like he's, this guy's sitting back. Like and I can I hear him on speaker. Even, I honestly didn't think it was real. Like I thought it was a dream. Yeah. I was having a dream. So, I mean, look, it's so, so I heard <laughs> that. And then basically... You know, he was like, oh, but I'm the great. Like, he said stuff to me that was like, I never heard the man speak. But when I, I was in my bed and I heard him saying these kind of things, he said, and this wasn't even on the footage that we have. He, he was literally talking to him for 10, 15 minutes before I know. there was footage of, you of came this. In. Yeah. But there was things he's like, hey, I feel sorry for you if you're poor and you're, you don't have money and you're, you know, I understand your problem, sir. But um, you know what? Um, it's understandable why you're mad at me. But I'm rich and I can help you. Like, he was saying stuff to be like what? And then he, and Lazy was like, I don't give a damn. Home. And Lazy's well off. Lazy's got money. Lazy ain't no chump. Lazy has businesses and he's a real man. I've known and, Lazy for and ten he's a years. Street, yes. And he's a street dude. Yeah. In Arizona, and he's talking to him like he's some poor kid in the ghetto. That like I can change your life. Chill out, bro. And he's like, I don't give a damn, homie. You are this and that. Woo, 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 woo. And this guy's still trying to brainwash the guy. So I'm laying in my bed like, wow, this guy's trying to brainwash this grown man that he's he's thinking is maybe a lame, and he's trying to tell him, chill out, bro. You know, you and know. this is at five thirty in the morning yeah. where we're at. So it's like six thirty in the morning in Houston or whatever. Exactly. So we're like, and and I'm not gonna lie. Like, me and Athena were there. It was me and Athena, Lazy, that, that guy that was yeah. kind of out of there. And then I think there was, like, one fan left in there or something yeah. like that. And then he ended up leaving. But um, I just remember that I was – I had been drinking. So yeah. I don't even remember 
I don't even remember too much. Well, I, you, 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 Athena or I do not remember. We're me and Athena were just like, what was this real? Like, did this happen? Well, yeah, it happened. So, and, <laughs> and, 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 so I'm just yeah. So I mean, and then you're gonna roll with the punches because it is what it is. And yeah. um, yeah. and then um, at the end of the day, he was telling him what's up and this and that. And and the words that I was seeing from his side of the point of view was like, damn, this guy thinks he's he's like. I'm the number one artist. Everyone likes me. I'm the number one, bro. You're talking to the number one. He's like, I don't give a damn if you're number one, number 10, number 20. You you got a jacket on you and this. So we got to the a heated debate. Obviously, then eventually I came to the room, see what's going on. Everything was uh, up in the purse and said what it is. And uh, at the end of the day, I think that was really like to the point where like it really hit you in the heart to realize that this yeah. situation is uh is crazy and no disrespect to whatever music he, someone was did or someone was a fan of the music but to me as a personal person uh anyone who's a chester from where i'm from um that just doesn't get no like play and love from my side